Hello and welcome back to the channel everybody. Today we've got the Bryant Bulldogs traveling to take on the Howard Bison in an ACC showdown. The first conference game for the Bulldogs. This is also the first time I will be usering the Bulldogs in this dynasty. Taking a quick look at the Bison team. We've got a couple good halfbacks, a good defensive tackle, free safety, and a middle linebacker. And then after that, their team is pretty bad. The Bryant Bulldogs at full strength. Nobody suspended, but Noel Montanez, that quarterback, uh, he struggled last week against the VMI Cadets. And there's a completion right off the bat for the Bison. But Montanez threw zero touchdowns and five picks last week against VMI. And here's Blunt in the open field. Tadian Moss tracks him down. And he actually broke his tackle too, but he gets taken down at the 23-yard line. Crowd going crazy. And there's a huge play by Divine Adams right up the middle, unblocked. Third and 11, Robinson, left side caught by Miller for the first down. Robinson to the end zone, picked off by Tadian Moss, his first career interception. And he's got a lot of space in front of him, and he finally gets chased down past the 50-yard line. That silenced the crowd pretty good right there. And here's Brandon Allen on the carry left side. He'll pick up 21 yards and a first down. And they'll go right back to Allen again, this time on the right side. And it looks like he'll get another first down inside the 10 down to the six yard line. Allen had 70 yards and two touchdowns last week with four broken tackles, one catch and 21 yards. And the other halfback, A.J. Jordan, who gets a carry here, punches it in the end zone for the touchdown. He only had one carry last week for 12 yards, but it was for a score. He also had one reception for two, uh, 10 yards, two pancakes, and a tackle on defense. Robinson, left side, passes deflected away and somehow caught and run over for the first down. Very interesting play, but Blunt fumbles the football. Ruben Blueberry recovers the fumble that is his first career fumble recovery and Reuben Blueberry had two tackles one tackle for a loss last week wasn't a big factor against the Cadets but here's Brandon Allen again getting the first down it seems every play on offense for the Bulldogs is a first down or more and there is Jordan picking up another first down Montana is going to keep this one himself and that <laughs> looks like it was a mistake as he is crushed and fumbles it Montanez to the air, left side caught by Snoopy Tucker, who only had one catch last week for three yards, but he did have a tackle, an interception, and a forced fumble, and there is another touchdown run here. That is Brandon Allen. That is his third on the season. He had two last week. Defense back on the field. That play is blown up by le left end Jay Owens. Toss out to the right side. Blunt in the open field. Hurdles. And he's still going past the 40, past midfield, trying to get pushed out of bounds. Reuben Blueberry showing some hustle, taking him out of bounds. There's a face mask, but he did save a touchdown. Blunt absolutely destroyed by Cy Summers, the unbelievable left outside linebacker for the Bulldogs. That brings up fourth and 10, and Smith is not even close to the first down marker. Cy Summers had three tackles, one tackle for a loss, an interception, and a fumble recovery last week against VMI. Montanez on the option. Brandon Allen gets it. Out of bounds at the 48-yard line for another first down, averaging 16.2 yards per carry. Montanez to throw it, and he is sacked. Waited too long in the pocket. And it didn't really look like anybody was open. Maybe LJ Topher there over the middle. He fitted in over the linebacker's head. Well, Montanez going to have to try to throw the ball again here. And he throws it out, deflected away, almost picked off by the outside linebacker. That brings up fourth and 15. And that is a nice kick to the 12-yard line. And Murphy breaks a tackle and is crushed by Stefan Okafor, the other outside linebacker. And that young man had seven tackles, two tackles for a loss, and a safety last week. And Howard punting the ball away again. Here's LJ Topher from the 35-yard line. Nice stiff arm and gets it to the 48-yard line. LJ Topher, four catches, 133 yards last week. And he had a pretty decent day in the return game as well. As Brandon Allen picks up another first down on the ground. 
Montanez out to him again. Another first down. This ground game is unstoppable, and he is just blowing through people like a bowling ball. Another 20-plus yard run. And the Bulldogs did miss an extra point at one point. I'm not sure if you guys noticed that. But here's Brandon Allen again, hurtling, breaking a tackle. He'll get the first down. As we see some more drop frames here from my lovely Elgato. There's a nice quick strike to Brandon Allen in the end zone for his first career receiving touchdown. Also the first passing touchdown for Noel Montanez. Took him two games, but he finally got it. Bryson go with a direct snap here. Blunt taken down for a loss by Cy Summers, who is having a fantastic day today. Robinson right side deflected away, almost intercepted by the right cornerback. Fourth and 12, they punt the ball away, and here are the Bulldogs again on offense. And to the right side, Snoopy Tucker inside the 15, down to the 12-yard line, first down for the Bulldogs in the red zone. And a perfect corner route. Corner didn't stand a chance. First and 10 from the 12. Brandon Allen to the outside. He's got the speed, and he's got the touchdown. Bulldogs pouring it on here in the first half. 27-0 over ACC foe, the Howard Bison. And Cy Summers with another big hit today. I believe all of his tackles are big hits, except for maybe one. Blunt to the outside. Has a good run here. Out of bounds. Crushed again by the safety this time. Non-subscriber player. Just lowers his shoulder right into him. My goodness. Less than a minute to go. Cy Summers breaks through the running back's block attempt, and that is his first career sack. That halfback stood no chance, and neither did the quarterback. Third and 18 now, less than 40 seconds here, and Robinson is sacked again. That is Owens for his second career sack on the season. Not sure why I said second career sack on the season, but you get the drift. 27 nothing at halftime. Bulldogs with 225 for total yards. Howard with 140 and two turnovers. Here's Noel Montanez keeping him for himself, breaking a tackle. Gets a nice block downfield, and he'll get it up to the 47-yard line. What a run by Noel Montanez. Allen on the sweep left side. A lot of space in front of him. Great blocking downfield. Finally chased down inside the red zone. First down from the 19-yard line now. Montanez rolling out right side. Wants Allen. That's picked off by the safety. Just jumped in front of that route. He's going to break a tackle here. Still going. And Allen chases him down. The intended target finally makes the tackle. Robinson right side almost picked off by the safety. Both quarterbacks struggling a little bit today. And here's Montanez going right side. Caught by McCoy for the first down up to the 46-yard line. 15 first downs today for Bryant. Montanez, quick pass out to Allen in the flats. And he'll pick up eight yards. Little dink and dunk offense seems to be working for them. Here's Jordan with a great spin move, a nice juke. And he holds on to the football at the 35-yard line. Another first down for Bryant. Screen pass to LJ Topher. He's in the open field. Past the 20, the 15, and to the 10-yard line. Caught. Taken down by the ankle. Third and goal from the 5-yard line. Quick strike to LJ Topher. His first career receiving touchdown. He had 133 yards last week, but it wasn't enough to get in the end zone. Now there's a nice route there. Right in front of the cornerback. 34-0 now. And he's blunt with another good run. He'll pick up another first down as Howard now is over the century mark for the day on the ground. Summers with another monstrous hit on Blunt. Makes it third and five. Toss play right side. And Summers is gonna take him down again for a loss. That is his eighth tackle of the game. And he is one of the most fun players to use her in this dynasty. He's just such a beast. LJ Topher on the return from the 24 yard line. Has some nice blocks. Right side in the open field, past midfield. And it doesn't look like anybody's going to catch him. He's going to have his first career punt return for a touchdown. And he's going to showboat in the end zone a little bit and get a 15-yard penalty. And that results in another missed extra point, my friends. And there's Cy Summers with another tackle for a loss. But they get him for the face mask. That'll bring up second and six instead of third and 18. Head coach Scott Goldberg on the sideline not happy with the ref. Putting his hand on him right there. And another huge hit here for Cy Summers. Unreal. 13 tackles in two games. Those are pretty good numbers. 
front left side and get some nice blocking to get the edge again. And Capers brings him down at the 46. Blunt having a really good game on the ground for the Bison. Over the middle, nice catch by Adkins. He'll have the first down and more up to the 27-yard line. Second and eight now. Play action. Robinson's going to take a shot towards the end zone. Picked off by Smith. And he's going to take this out of the end zone. Juke his way all the way to the 17-yard line. Turnover for Howard. Not what they need right now. Down 40 points at home to a conference opponent. And here's an option play. Jordan has the ball. Runs right by the safety. And he's going to take this one down the sideline and into the end zone for the Bryant Bulldog touchdown. Look at the speed. It's blazing. 82-yard touchdown run. And that is just insane. He only had 12 yards last game, folks. Blunt with a nice reception over the middle for 15 yards and a first down. Howard still looking for the first points of this contest. Robinson pressured. Cy Summers hits him as he throws it, and that pass hits the grass. Bryant gets the ball again here. Is now uh, AJ Jordan almost gets loose again, this time to the 28-yard line. And he's got 137 yards today. Brandon Allen with a buck 68. And Jordan gets loose again. Past the 50. And he is going to take this one all the way. It doesn't even look like he is sprinting right now. And he just outruns everybody. And I'm pretty sure that brings him over the 200-yard mark for the day. And this dual-back system the Bryant Bulldogs have in place is pretty much unstoppable. If you just take the game film from this game, both halfbacks had no problem running through holes today. By Summers, another monstrous hit. That'll bring up second and 15. Blunt, or Howard now, the backup halfback, he gets big hit. I think that was Ruben Blueberry with the hit that time. And Rhodes is sacked, and that is Divine Adams tallying his second career sack. And he pretty much just blows right by the halfback. Why would you put a halfback on a humongous defensive tackle? But that was pretty much the story for this game. The Bison were just outmatched in every facet of this game. Their offensive line was getting bullied. Tight ends couldn't do anything. Receivers had a couple nice catches, but not enough to get on the scoreboard. 54 nothing, folks. So Bryant... The Bulldogs have scored 87 points on the season and only allowed 7. 20 first downs today, 528 yards of offense, 393 on the ground. Only sacked once, one turnover today, and that was a crazy tip pass for the pick. And two touchdowns per quarter for Bryant. The two missed extra points. One because of a 15-yard penalty by Mr. L.J. Tilfer after the touchdown. And the other one was just me being awful at kicking with terrible kickers. Montanez, not a bad day today. The halfbacks, of course, balled out of their minds. Five touchdowns combined. And just, it's insane how many yards they had together. Three broken tackles for Allen. Zero broken tackles today for A.J. Jordan. He mostly just used his speed to get loose in the open field and be gone. LJ Tilfer with a drop today. Kenneth Harrington, 10 pancakes. And look at all these non-subscriber players. Offensive linemen getting a lot of pancakes. And Noel Montanez got a pancake at the quarterback position. What is going on? Cy Summers, I had 11 tackles with him today. Eight for a loss, one sack. Jay Owens had a phenomenal day as well. And so did Divine Adams, this entire defense. It wasn't even fair. The Bison could do nothing. The Bulldogs could do no wrong. If you just take away that interception, which was just a great play by the corner to be aware of where the ball was tipped, the entire Bulldogs team was just unmatched. Two picks today. Tadian Moss gets his first career interception. Returned 55 yards. He also had two deflections. Fumble recovery for Mr. Reuben Blueberry, his first of his career. Kick returns, LJ Tilfer, 1 for 25. Seven punt returns, 119 yards, one touchdown. Two total touchdowns for him today. Three total touchdowns for Brandon Allen. And Jordan, of course, had a great day. 
week four, we see the Bulldogs again as they host ACC foe, the Morgan State Bears. That should be a good matchup. Our next game and last game for week three will be the Jacksonville Dolphins, who are 0-1 on the season, hosting the 1-0, 25th ranked FIU Golden Panthers. I'll see you guys with that one tomorrow. Take it easy, guys.